Oh, I, uh, a perception of the players of on players. the football pitch. And uh, I tried uh, then to, how do I call that? And I call that s scanning. And I tried to see what happens to a player in the 10 seconds before he gets the ball. How many times does he take information? And what is the quality of information he takes? And of course, you have uh, different times available. When you play at the back, we have one to two seconds to make a decision. When you play in midfield, you have 0.5 to 0.2 seconds to make a decision. When you play completely in the final third, you have uh, 0.1 to 0.2 seconds to make the decision. So the perception has, the speed of perception has, of course, to change as well. And I uh, realized uh, we uh, installed cameras everywhere, you know, because it's, it's so complicated to see uh, how many times you scan because you have to analyze the movement of the eye as well because before you get the ball, you can just sometimes look at the socks. And we worked with 200 students to tell you how difficult it was. 50% gave up after three weeks because it's such a, a, a tremendous work that... Uh, and we uh, made a, a complete study with a Norwegian university. And in fact, what is very interesting is that the good players, the very good players, scan six to eight times in the last 10 seconds before they get the ball. And uh, the normal players, three to four times.